Hello everyone, welcome back to my channel. My name is Mosley and today I want to do a short review of five makeup wipes. And um, recently, I somehow just want to do a little bit review videos that um, they are only based on my personal opinions. They are paid by my own money. Um, if I happen to offend some kind of company, I'm really sorry, but this is what happened to me. And I just want you all to know, if you're trying to see if I want to try another makeup wipes and this happened to be something you want to try about, maybe you want to know what I'm thinking about it. So I'm just going to drop right into it. Um, the first product I'm actually taking is the Altmay one. Um, this one is what I got. It's the Altmay makeup remover wipes and it's um, in night nice soothing flavor. Um, the scent of it, it actually does smell like what it's supposed to be, like vanilla and kind of scent. It just smells, um, yeah, it smells, it does smell soothing. It's not like lavender kind of soothing, but I do like it. And, um, I have to say, I like the packaging. That's why I got it at the first scent. And then it also says soothing. My skin, if you have noticed, I have a lot of bumps, a lot of acne on my face recently. I'm pretty stressed out. Also eat a lot of fried food and everything. So I really didn't, does need this to see if we actually do anything on my skin. Um, I tried it out. It's, it smells soothing, that's what I have to say, but with the price range, I believe it's $5.99 in my purse um, in Walmart or something around that range. And then it came with 25 wipes, and I have to say 25 wipes is pretty regular around what usually you can get in drugstore. Um, the wipe itself... It's a very soft kind of fabric. I do like it on that part, but on the other hand, it's not moisturizing enough. So it's kind of dry in my opinion. It's not like um, some of the other wipes I'm going to tell you about in a little bit later. Um, this wipe is actually kind of dry. Um, it's the kind of thing that I usually, if I need it, I just use my makeup remover liquid, like cleansing water or stuff like that. Just pour a little bit on it just to get it a little bit more. Um, wet so I can soak off my makeup instead of dragging through my skin um, if you all know what I'm talking about uh, yeah so I would say this scent wise 5 out of 5 I do like it but um, if you're saying taking off my makeup I would say 3.5 out of 5 so yeah the next one, the next one I'm talking about is actually one of the pricier one, and I'm talking about the Honest Beauty. Um, you all have to excuse this packaging being really dirty, so you can tell I actually have used it. Um, this is a little trial size, and it's refreshing, clean, that kind of um, thing it talks about, and. Um, it has like dermatology test and whatever things on the back. This is seven sheet. Like I said, it's a trial sheet. Um, I get it in Target. It is two fifty for seven sheet. So if you think about it, that's like five dollar for f fourteen sheets. That's kind of pricey in my opinion. Um, but I have to talk about it. I get it um, during my trip to Chicago. So I actually need something in my package that's not super, super bulky like this. You know, the whole pack. I don't need that much. I just need like five or six of them because I'm only traveling for six, uh, three days. So the maximum I can get is pretty much... I would say five pages, uh, five pieces of them, because uh, you know, like two nights. So that's like two to three, I would say. Yeah. So this is pretty ideal for two to three this trip, and I have to say, it worth the money. It's not like miracle that kind of things, but the fabric itself is not stretching my skin, and the um, the wipes itself is pretty wet. And then I have to say, it does remove my makeup pretty good. Usually, my this kind of full face full face makeup. I can use maybe like one sheet and like a half, like one and a half. I'll pretty much be done. So I'm pretty impressed by this. And I do recommend it if you're going for traveling or you think you can afford the pricier side of drugstore. I mean, you got it in Target. So I do consider it a drugstore. Um, if you want that kind of deal, I mean, it's not too bad, two fifty. So I do recommend it. Um, I would get it scent size. I don't... 
I don't feel much of that scent, so it's pretty much not much scent. I didn't smell anything like strong like the last one, the All May one. Um, but this one, makeup removing size, I would give it 5 out of 5. The next one I'm talking about is our good old friend, e.l.f. Cosmetic. So this one caught all my attention because actually in my city I've never seen this in the shop. I may have seen it once or twice but it wasn't. I wasn't in the mood to try it out. And then I found this. It is hydrating water cleansing cloth. And it says it's alcohol free and also it has aloe, vitamin B and E. Like all all the other e.l.f. products because they're all amazing and great and their price are so good uh, but this product I have to say price range is four dollars four dollars for 20 sheets that's not terrible because that is actually like I don't know like one dollar five sheets so that's pretty good deal uh, but on the other hand I have to say this has the same kind of problem. It's not wet enough. When I try to take off my makeup, I have to wet it up first. Even not with cleansing water like micellar water, I still need a little bit of water, even tap water, just to wet it up a little bit so I can take off my makeup like I want it to be instead of dragging off my skin. And I have to say, hydrating water side, I don't feel much hydrating because, you know, it's dry. Uh, I, I'm pretty sure I got a brand new pack. Um, I got it in Target. I got like it's brand new pack because I when I peeled it off, like it's like really good. I like it's tight on it. If you know what I'm talking about, so I'm pretty sure it's not like opened already, but it's really dry, and I kind of hard had a hard time to make it work on my skin. Uh, scent size, I don't smell that much scent. Um, it pretty much don't smell like anything. Yeah, it just smells like regular makeup wipes. Um, and then makeup takeoff size, I would say three or maybe even 250 when I open it up for two days. So, but still, if you wanna just to give like a little swatch taken off or you just anything like on your hand or like on your neck, you don't care about your skin, you can wet it up a little bit to use it. If you're really tight on the budget, you have to save that like one dollars, two dollars, because the next thing I'm introducing you are working pretty good um i do say maybe you want to try this out because it it does it is cheap but i don't say it take up makeup that well it actually took me three full sheets and my own mouth of water to take off my whole makeup the other day so i have to say i do not actually recommend this product the next product I'm talking about is the good old Garnier Skin Active. So this line, I have used up one bottle of their micellar water, one bottle of their pink micellar water, so one blue, one pink. That's two full bottles, two full bottles, three packs of these, but in different colors. I've tried a black one, I've tried a pink one, I've tried the blue one. So this the blue one, I actually reached back to it and got another one from it. Um, this one is from Walmart, I believe it's $5.99 or something along that range. Um, it came with 25 sheets, I believe. Yeah, it's 25 sheets. Um, it's pretty good deal. And I have to say, this is actually my best go-to when I'm trying to take off my makeup. Because it is uh, wet enough. It does not have strong scent, in my opinion. It takes my makeup pretty well. The fabric is not as good as the Honest one. Because I do like the Honest one pretty pretty much like I do consider paying that money is worth it but this one the Garnier one I do also like it because it's a lot cheaper it's only $5.99 I mean you can't beat it on the price and then you got twi 25 sheets that are all wet enough to take off my makeup so I do love them and the next one I'm talking about it is even better which is still from Garnier Skin Active and this is just um, Garnier Skin Active clean soothing makeup remover Moving cleansing towel it. Um, this um, packaging is actually a little bit different from that one because this one you can go like this, but this one you go like in a different um, different section. But I have to say. I thought I liked this one better before I try out this one, but I have to say I prefer this one a lot more. Um, so this one does not have any kind of fragrance and I do like it because um, a lot of times I 
just prefer anything to be done fast. I don't want the fragrance in my head. And if you have sensitive skin, sometimes you may not want to deal with the fragrance part. Um, so I have to say this is really good and it is soothing on my skin. It does not irritate my skin much. Usually if I take off my makeup, my whole face around here and here, they're just red and all my bumps are like right so red and you can see everything every single scar every single pore on my skin but this one actually make that thing calm down a lot it does not make it so irritated and the fabric inside of it i do like it the price is also 5.99 25 sheets you cannot beat it it's good enough and i i do prefer this one now you can tell like See, I've been using this a lot more. So, yeah. Um, so, so, along all the makeup wipes I have talked about today, um, all in all, I do prefer the Honest one and then the Skin uh, Guardian Skin Active one, but in the soothing version. Um, if you want to go travel, this one, Seven Sheets, $2.50. I, I believe you, you want to get it because, I mean, it's so small, it's, it fits in your purse. And this one, if you're in go-to, you just don't feel like using the makeup cotton things, soak on your skin or stuff like that. You just want to wipe it off and go to sleep. This is the one you're going to. So thank you all for watching my video today. Um, if you like my video, please give me a like. If you want to, please give me a subscribe and leave me some kind of comment below. Let me know what you want me to talk about, what you want me to review. And I would like to see you all later. See ya.